gets a full toss to Prayer. It's out towards the boundary and taken by Phoebe Litchfield. So while the power surge can bring runs, it also has the chance of producing wickets. And there's the third for the Sydney Thunder. And that's a very dangerous batter that's been sent back to the sheds. Great catch, Phoebe Litchfield. And well bowled, Sammy Joe Johnson. See here, maybe just that off cut a slower ball. It was a full toss. Low full tosses can be difficult to hit. And uh, Phoebe Litchfield didn't make any mistake. Set herself nice and early. Mignon Dupree, she was the outstanding batter in game one against the Thunder, 33 off 27. And bold. So tried something a little different with the reverse, Heather Graham and Sammy Joe Johnson was right on line. And the fourth wicket is down for the Hurricanes. We sense a bit of frustration from Heather Graham. Difficult shot and a difficult wicket. Wasn't able to connect to that reverse. Just went straight through. As well, bold as well. Slower delivery. Trying to hit it. Just couldn't get anything on it. And it is very much a premeditated shot, the reverse sweep. And unfortunate for Heather Graham there that it was. Treneman walking to the offside, making room on the leg side. And this will be an almost certain run out. So Treneman is gone. Fortunately for the Hurricanes, they're going to have a new batter facing the final ball. It is going to be Naomi Stalenberg. Just selfless batting. Pushed the twos hard and she sort of started stopped. <laughs> Probably resigned to the fact that she wasn't going to get back. Had a good wee innings. 